Skyla. Hey, Skyla. Don't. Scotty. No, not again. We don't destroy the beast. That dungeon, our kingdom, perish. It is up to us. Oh, what kind of plan is that? We do it this way. Stephen, you take Romlu and Yak around the side of a dungeon and attack it from there. Ro, Tyken, you go on top of the dungeon and wait for my signal. When we weaken it, you go down with the final bang and boosh! Victory is ours! Shut up! Later. Everyone with me! Do it! Together. Hello? This is she. He heard what? Let me get this right. You went into the forest to kill a monster that was in your head. Then you threw a stick in the air 
and it hit you in the eye. Oh my god. Dang, that's gotta hurt worse than a bee sting in your privates. What? Don't you think that hurt? Not really. In Galaxy Rider Crest, the amount hit point you lose. Marky, cool it. No one wants to hear about your dumb games. Why were you in the forest? Because that's what he's always doing. Where were you? Sleeping? I was talking to you guys through my mind. Tom, dude, we can't hear. Like, I'm saying stuff in my mind right now, and you all can't hear me, right? That's because of side mission fraud. For the love of shut your mouth! Leave alone, man. You're not the boss of me. Not now, Tyler. What, you had chicken? I didn't say it was! You look like you're about to kiss. Ew, gross! Why would you say that, man? Dylan, what the heck? That's like, you're getting it later! That's just what I saw! No! Oh, no! Just, no! Stop! Don't no, 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 we are going to! Please, please, please. You're getting it later! No, I'm sorry! You're getting it later! Please! You're getting it later, okay? Did you guys see something different? Yeah! Okay! You fools, I tell you. Fools! You have no idea what's coming. When Ant's son come up, and it's dawn. Slipper Sam is gonna lay waste on this town. It's up to us. We've been through a lot, Gib. We played, we fought, and we fought some pretty darn good wisdom cows. <sighs> I think it's Rufus. Fellas, there's some things I want to say. Look at each other. These might be the last time we see these faces. Go on, get a good look. These are the faces of your partners, your best friends, your brothers. And either we take down, slip for Sam together, or die. Protecting each other's butts. <laughs> now gather up, boys. We got a tail to. Miss, what seems to be the trouble? Who are they? Wallace, Walter, Will, Willie, Rufus, and Harry. What do you want here, miss? I ain't got time to talk to an outsider. Can I hear your real voice? My what? Your voice. Your real one. Do you think this is funny? Can I play? No! Wait, what? I want to play with you. I want to join your gang. Do you think you got what it takes? Just wait till Slippery Sam. <laughs> I have told you, and I've told you again and again, you do not take off without telling me. Do you know how worried I get for you? Terrified. I never know where you're going. I don't know what you're doing. I mean, Scotty, honey, normal kids don't act like this. And then the last thing I need, <laughs> someone calls me up and tells me that my son hurt his own eye. It's coming. Scotty, what if something worse were to happen to you, hmm? What if somebody was to... Scotty, can you even hear me? Scotty? What are you saying? I can't understand you. Oh. It's coming!
What's the mission here? Look there. Uh, it's a dog. Yeah, it is. You see it and you think it's dumb. A whole bunch of machine parts and metal thingamajigs that are busted and no one wants them because they don't work anymore. They're not shiny, like the watch. It's old, rusty, broken. That's how you see it. To me, this is paradise. There's so much cool stuff here. That big metal thing can be a cool battle weapon. That, that, that big blanket on the car can be a magic line thing or a portal to another dimension. Um, those, those cars over there can be a, a, a house for us. We can have meetups, go on adventures together. It can be whatever we want. No one wants to join me. It's fantasy. It's not real. But... Friends I make here... They're more real to me. It's so good to see you again. I mean, I haven't seen you in ages, and things have been... Shenship this monster! I'll call you back. Scotty? Scotty, wait. Yes! Scotty! Scotty! Wait! Scotty! Scotty, you need to just listen! I'm just trying... Scotty, calm down! Scotty? Scotty? Scotty, mommy just wants to talk to you, honey. Ah! No, 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 no. Oh, not again. No, no, don't do that. No. Ah! Shape shifting monster! Listen to me. I need you to settle down. No! Let me go! Shape shifting monster! Listen, whatever you're seeing, it's not real. It's all in your head. Your mother, Scotty, mommy, help me! Scotty, they're not, they're not. Mom, right. help me! Yes, Scotty, mommy, mommy, that's right. I'm Mom, here. where are you? I'm right here. Please look at me, Scotty. Save me, Mom. I'm right here. I'm right here. No. You're not mom. Who are you? Uh. Scotty! No! Come back! <laughs>
Isn't that what you said? Ben, please, I can't. You're talking about this! And why can't you just let go of the past? This isn't about the past, Skyla. This is about what's right for us. What's right for us? Where do you get off saying what's right for us? After what you put us through! I, I didn't mean... Things were different back then. I never meant to hurt him. But you sure did a damn good job, considering your situation. And how is this any different? This isn't hurting our son. Do you hear yourself? Do you hear yourself, woman? I'm not the time to talk. Ben, I'm actually trying to help Scotty. Help him? Honey, dear. You control and belittle him. I only do that because he can't control himself. He's a seven-year-old kid. He's not like any seven-year-old kid that I have ever seen. He's not like other kids. Ben, he runs around talking, yelling things that don't make sense. He takes off, and I don't know where he's going. He acts like he's not even here. Like he's somewhere else in his own mind, and I can't reach him. Ben, honey, he needs help. Keeping him in the house doesn't help. Well, what do you want me to do? I have tried everything. Nothing works, Ben. Nothing. Ben, I try to be a good mom. I try. I am a good mom, Ben. I'm a good mom. changes? What if he ends up being some nutcase living on the streets in a slum? Because of me. Because of us. It's going to be my fault. All my fault. Uh, Skyla, you're not making any sense. Don't tell me what I am. Are those new? Uh, yeah, they were tucked away for a while until now. I was a little worried they'd break. You know how families can be. Beautiful. <laughs> Especially with kids. Uh, you got that right. <laughs> so, what'd you do? Excuse me? I haven't seen you for a while until now. What brings you all the way here? Well, <sighs> We were trying to get Tyler to play Magic Guzzle with us, but he said he didn't want to play stupid card games. And then I said he was stupid for not wanting to play with his friends. And then he punched me, and then he said I was a dumbass, and I told him that's a bad word, and I told him that he can show. Hey, hey, hey. <sighs> with me now. So, he hit you? Yeah, right here. Can't you see it? It's really hard. I see. Ooh, that's a big one. So, what are you going to do? Hit him back? Dylan? Okay, okay. Tell him it wasn't nice. Mm -hmm. 
And he's being a mean friend and should die in a hole. Exactly. Maybe leave that last part out. Then call him a butthead behind his back. Well, uh, just make sure he doesn't hear that last part. I will. <sighs> did I, did you just, what? Did he just, what? Michaela, did you just send him back? What if he gets hurt again? It's fine. He'll get hurt again. Listen, kids are rowdy. They're bound to get into a fight at some point. And if they get hurt, they'll learn not to do it again to others. Okay, maybe that's terrible advice. Maybe I'm not a good mother. So what? No one is. But I trust him. Somehow I just... I know he'll figure it out. Do you see where I'm getting at? Speaking of which, how's Scotty, by the way? He doesn't hang around Dylan as much. Scotty's, he's... Actually... Kids ever seem to think that their parents are invisible? Thing has been the same since that night. That night? Yeah, um... I, I was sitting on a bed reading. Scotty was playing with this like, ball of string that he just couldn't seem to set down. <laughs> and in he walks. My husband, drunk out of control. I see Scotty playing. No, anyone else would have thought it was fine. He's just playing. I don't know what he thought. But he started yelling. <laughs> Screaming at him. He's a disappointment. I couldn't believe my ears. Do you know what that does to a child? I told Scotty. happening again and again and again till one night he had one too many he got in his car and bam he hit a tree then he realizes his mistake but by then it was too late the damage was already done I could see it in Scotty's eyes he had a hard time looking at me he looked at me less and less, until one day, he just stopped. I just want him to see me as his mother again, instead of a monster. What's happening with Scotty here? <laughs> <laughs> Michaela, I love you. He's just, he's off in his own little world. I can't reach him. Maybe he's just trying to be happy. Weirdo. How else is a kid supposed to handle trauma at that age? 